Greetings, YouTube. Today's story comes out of Pekin, Illinois, a place I will honestly have no idea where it is. Um, apparently, a 23-year-old man purchased three items at a Kroger's store. A Coleman fuel, matches, and pseudofedrin. This seems suspicious to the store ma owner, store manager, who contacted police, who then, uh, using the description of the individual and his car, hunted him down and arrested him for suspicion on, uh, for possession of drug paraphernalia or drug possession of items to make drugs. I have a problem with this. This person bought three legal items in the world of capitalism that is what we do we buy and sell and trade and barter legal items and he was arrested for producing or suspicion of producing drugs even though he had done nothing with the items in question he was caught outside the store he could have used those items for no purpose. At one time, we had the concept of you are innocent until proven guilty. That you are presumed innocent until unproven proven guilty. It's a lovely turn of phrase. I always thought it was very popular. But apparently, in the 21st century, it's gone out of fashion. Which kind of breaks my heart. What this man was arrested for today, in my opinion, or the other day, in my opinion, is no different than if you were to park your car near a bank and were then arrested for bank robbery. Well, you parked your car near a bank. You could have robbed the bank. We might as well arrest you just in case you were going to rob a bank. This guy didn't break the law. He bought legal things. He did nothing illegal with them. It doesn't matter what his intent was. It doesn't matter what the manager or the store owner thought. He did nothing illegal. And yet, he got arrested for having legal things. Does this not strike anyone else as just a smidge draconian? Can someone else join me in the chanting of the phrase police state? This is just stunning. This is still America, right? Let me check something. Yep, 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 yep. We're still supposed to have a Bill of Rights. Right there. See? Bill of Rights! I don't remember where in this document it says that it's okay to arrest somebody for buying legal things and doing nothing with them. So uh, our lesson today is that in the 21st century, this is apparently no longer popular.